I have you now. Nehan Jakujo. Fool, you just made your last mistake. You may possess the blade now, but without him to wield it, it poses no real threat to me. Wrong, demon. Songetsu's wrath and mine are now one. You used Jebel, and now you will pay! <laughs> Very amusing, wench. I do not have time for this. But, seeing as I need your crystal, you leave me no choice. Your wretched plans end here! Bail, King of Kings, must be summoned! Arise, myself and my shadow!
Dimension shift! Kah! Dimension shift! Dimension shift! So even Gremory has failed me. Alfred was afraid of what you could do with the shards, but not I. Look at you. Is that what you wanted? The crystal? You betrayed us, Dominique. Oh, don't think me ungrateful. I have you and Johannes to thank for teaching me the alchemist lore and how to control the shards. Shards, I might add, which you gave to me of your own will. Your sacrifice has become my strength. Why are you doing this? Because once again, the demons appeared, and once again God stayed silent. While his servants were slaughtered mercilessly one by one. So I began to wonder, what if there is no God? What if the Lord we grovel and pray before is a lie, and our faith draws power from some other nameless, unspeakable thing? If so, I wash my hands of it. Because God can rot. I decided to seek a higher power, the power to slay gods. Do you realize how many people have died as a result? They deserve to die because they were weak, and more will follow until I obtain all I desire. This whole mess wasn't enough for you? If the last summoning had been enough, I wouldn't have had to bring you here. You're after a more powerful demon. Sheeple's crystal wasn't enough to summon it, so you needed mine instead. Smart girl. I like that. But your crystal was too clean, too pure. So I made sure you would obtain shards and acclimate yourself to demonic power. Then Gremory could possess you after the battle with Jebel had worn you down. <sighs> if Zangetsu hadn't betrayed me... <sighs> Doing the right thing isn't a betrayal. You know what? I never expected to be put in a corner like this. You leave me no choice but to play my final card. <sighs> I will use my crystal and the Libelogaith to summon Bale, the ultimate demon! Do you realize what will happen to you? Do you? You don't, so I'll tell you. There's a reason Jebel survived ten years ago. What does he have to do with this? It was in his blood. An exorcist, like me. Our blood suppressed the crystal corruption and effectively spared his life. And now I have surpassed him. I command the crystal through Enochian script. No demon is too powerful for me to summon, even if I cannot keep it here forever. But the process is slow, because I can see the summoning isn't complete. Do you really think you can stop me before then? Oh yes I do. You don't understand what power is for. You wield it stupidly, arrogantly. And now you will pay the price. Ah! Ah! Arise myself and my child!
disarray.
She could have done so much good. I know. Wait. The Liebe Logaya. The book that started it all. What are you going to do with it? The same thing the Master was trying to do. Before he died, he inscribed Enochian letters onto each of the castle's structural weaknesses. Now, I will use the book to perform a rite here at the heart of the castle. The rite will activate the Enochian script and send the castle and demons back from whence they came. That's what Alfred was trying to accomplish. We need to begin. Stand back, Miriam. Taking you permanently. Really? I can't make any promises, but yes, I think. Well, thank you, Johannes. You're very welcome. Come on, let's go home. All right.